My name is Lynette Houses. I'm Chiricahua Apache, tribal member of the San Carlos Apache tribe in Arizona. I'm also Diné and House Pueblo. I grew up on Arizona Reservation, Apache Reservation in Phoenix, and I've grown up here in New Mexico, in Taos Pueblo, and in the Four Corners in the Navajo Nation. I'm mostly known for my murals. I'm based here in Albuquerque, New Mexico, and I create large-scale paintings in public spaces in an effort to rematriate spaces. I've always been an artist. Uh, I've been an artist my whole life. I think it's all about creating different mediums to express yourself in. So I've done so many different artistic expressions from you know screen printing to acting to theater to now it's more into fine arts and public art and large scale paintings. So you know all my life I've always been creative and now I'm really focusing into uh, my painting and large scale murals and public art and really bringing into representation of native people and, and indigenous rights as well. And I graduated from New Mexico Highlands University with my social work degree. And so that really informs how I practice my art and working with different communities respectfully and having specific content to work with cultural sensitivity and different kinds of representations. And, and with that, that knowledge of, of consent and, and content that's relevant to that community and that space. So in my murals, I really like to have that large scale indigenous representation out there in the world. When I was little, I was fortunate enough to see large scale representations of native people in sculptures throughout Phoenix when I was small, and that really played a part in how I grew up and how I saw myself as a Native woman. And it really instilled how important it is to have that representation out there in the world for young people, not only na Native people, young indigenous youth, but people in general to see themselves, people of color, um, you know, to have exposure to different cultures as well is very important. So the piece behind me, the mural behind me, is here at 516 Arts in Albuquerque, New Mexico. And it is part of the exhibition, Southwest Contemporaries, 12 New Mexico Artists to Know Now, 2023. And I am honored to be one of the artists this year. And for this piece and this exhibition is called She Walks with the Sun. And it is about a 22 foot high piece uh, by about 18 feet wide. And it took me about seven days. And every mural is different um, depending on the size and the scale and the design. But this piece in particular, it took me seven days. And I'm really proud of it. It really uh, speaks to my Apache culture and that large scale matriarch representation. In Apache culture, the sun is very important and relevant. Our culture surrounds a lot of our important ceremonies around the sun. And so when we are gifted these blessings from the sun, we hold that responsibility of having that light from the sun as we walk in this earth and through our daily lives. And so this mural represents that sun's blessing that she holds, she walks with the sun as she goes out into the world. It's about holding your light and holding on to your light in this world and holding on to your gifts and not being afraid to shine your light. Um, you know, this piece is really site specific and temporary and I think that's kind of the beauty of murals sometimes. I call them, you know, ephemeral, you know? They're temporary and sometimes you just catch them in that moment. And, and that's really beautiful too of, of that moment in time. And, and that's the name of the mural game as well as when we do murals, it's like giving it to the community. Um, and it's 
for them as a gift to take care of and preserve and, and sharing it. I think that's, that's really actually really freeing as an artist too.